Hello, this is episode 18 of KTFM. This is Carl James Langford and... So, Tom, episode 18, what do you think? I can't believe there's only 18 episodes. I mean, it feels like we've been doing it much longer. Well, we have been doing it much longer, haven't we? Yeah, we, we, did, have that, we did have that huge break. Um, that, that weird, yeah. funny break for Which about a month, yeah. Yeah, long enough. It's not regular. It's not supposed to be. But how many weeks is that, you know? Uh, well, we've we been... Uh, I don't know. I mean, I'm sure we got our diehard fans like Liam and... Yeah, we've been doing it for about a month now. I'm sure we got our diehard fans like Liam and... And April and whoever who would who would be able, actually actually it's our it's our listenership will actually tell us um, how long we've been going so probably about um, five months I think. Well, one of our first shows was about the fusion point toilets, wasn't it? Uh, yeah, exactly. Do you remember that? Yeah, I, I do. I do. Um, that that this was. Episode is kind of got a little bit of a sequel, a bit of a follow up to that. Right? Do you know why? Oh no, Tom! Are you, are you trying to say we got toilets again? Well, yeah, kind of. Sorry. I worked in a hotel. It was a shit hole. I came back to security. I'm back at that same building again tonight. Fusion point. You did, you did, you did have um, experiences in toilets, though, didn't you, back then? So, so in other words, right? Everyone likes a good toilet story. So, Tom, this is toilet night. Um, I I reckon I I reckon that one personally right. There's no need to daub um, feces all over the wall. Um, and, and 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 secondly, if if I had an employee, um, as as you had an employee um, eight months ago or whenever it was, um, who was like justifying daubing all over the walls because he had no toilet paper or whatever it was, um, that person. I I, 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 I got to be honest with you, right? I got I got to ask you one question, right? Would I be justified in saying that female toilets are a lot cleaner than male? Now, come on, you're the expert on this. All right, I don't know. Yeah, go on. No. No, 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 Tom. How? how I, I got to be honest with you. It, uh, you know, um, when, when I when I used to when I used to give lectures in a place in Bridgend, I always used to use the female toilets because um, they were cleaner than the male. Except for one experience I had. I went. That's Bridgend you're talking about. Remember, that's So, and the so can can I um can I ask you for one example? Or can I can I just ask you for another example of how bad a female toilet is, and then one example of a male toilet? Just give it to us. And this is in female toilets? Yeah. It's not always that extreme, of course, but that's the worst. You know, here is probably the worst place I've seen it. Fusion point, right? But that toilet in particular, that was not an exaggeration of that. That was the truth. Right. So, so, so let's have another example of a male toilet because you've got, you've got to be, you've got to be fair. Yeah. Come on. Do 
twice, three times, eight, whatever. Toilet paper, pour all over the seat, piss all over the floor. You're going there, right? It's like going into the shallow end of a swimming pool. I, I can I can I just add right okay so so if if somebody said to you right this is an academic question right um you got you got you've only got to give one example not not a load if somebody said to you um if you're an alien and the alien said how to how do you identify a dirty male toilet and how do you identify a dirty female toilet what's the majority of horrible stuff in a female toilet what's the majority of a horrible stuff in a male toilet I'm an alien I want to identify a male, male horrible toilet. Just one example of just, just in the one. Male toilet, right? Yeah. In the male toilet, it's usually piss on the floor, and it's usually shit, rubbed, like handprints as well, on the inside of the cubicles, like the walls. In a female toilet, <laughs> it's similar, but there's more toilet paper that's been thrown out onto the floor and around the seat. And obviously, there's a lot more what, the exclusives to these toilets. It's Tampons and um, pads covered in blood, you know, just used, just discarded on the floor where they don't use the bins. Uh, um, right, and so. They stink as well, the female toilets. They stink worse than the men's, believe it or not. Do you know what? Do you know what? Right, you 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 went to Barry Boys Comprehensive School, right? Did you ever go over to Bryn Averin? I used to always be over Bryn Averin because I always used to mix the girls in it. Right, did you ever go in the female toilets in Bryn Averin? Be no, I can't say I had, no. Because I went over Bryn Avon a few times. I I think I, w I had to go in the female toilets once because I gave, I was given a talk over there, right? And and the female toilets in Bryn Avon absolutely stank compared with the male ones in Barry Boys. I don't. Really? I, yeah, I don't know why that was. It was a weird. There was a weird smell about it. I don't. I don't know why. So so you've actually, um, yeah, you, you you've actually said it. <laughs> Yeah, but the thing the thing is right the thing is right I, 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 I can't in there's no way can I justify it. I, I can't say that there's a reason why you would you would do that, rub rub feces on the wall. I I can't say shit because I'm I'm using the word feces because it sounds a lot better, but it don't. There's there's no I, I'm trying to I, I'm 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 trying to I'm trying to make it better. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, I know. So so. Kind of, we're kind of worse than all because we're sort of gone out of our own way in our own time. Well, I'm doing it in work time currently. You usually do my own time. Yeah. To talk about what's going on in the toilets on a radio show. I I I got I got to be honest with you, right? No, I, I actually, 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 to be honest with you, Tom, the the the, the answer is right, and I'll I'll give you the bog, uh, sorry, the bog honest answer, and there's no pun there, right? Um, no, nobody talks about toilets in this country. They just don't, right? We, uh, British people, I, you know, I, I I don't I don't talk about toilets and stuff with with my own partner, right? I just don't do it. We just don't talk about it, right? So. I, I don't think it's talked about at all. Okay, this, whoever's listening to this, right? I, I'm going to say this, right? As an actor, right? And Tom is an actor as well. Um, how many times? How many times out of out of all the time you stu you watch films, right? And 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 anything, right? Have you seen them portraying somebody go into the toilet in any way, shape, or form? Out of out of out of the out of the amount, how many how many times? And, and and that's it. So so basically, um, I I don't I don't know. What's that? Well, exactly. Exactly. How many how many times have you seen James Bond go into the toilet? We don't we don't we we don't see anyone having a wee either. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, but 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 in in on average, on average you don't, and and I think, 
I, I think such such a natural thing like going to the going to the loo, right? Um, it, it's not it's not it's not done. You know, it, you know. Put it put it this way, right? Um, they they want to dramatize films by having horrible things like rape, and they they want to dramatize films by um, having people killed, or they want to dramatize films by having somebody beheaded, right? Those are not things that happen every week, right? You know, um, and and it, but every day, every human, well, ninety nine percent of all humans on the planet go to toilet every day. Obviously, there's one or two people who hold on to it, right? Um, but but it's a perfectly natural thing. Do, do you know? Do you know when? Do you know that first um, production that you did? Um, there was a guy urinating up against a sign. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's I, right. Yeah, Keith. I thought that was absolute brilliant. I I thought that was brilliant because because it was um, an iron road in Barry, A N E U R I N, named after the politician an iron Bevan, um, and they they basically the guy was standing alongside the one bit and and he's demonstrating going to go and having a pee, and then you got the urine next to it, which I thought was brilliant, right? But that was that was pure comedy. As a serious note, you don't have this at, at all. And and um, and I tell you what, right? From from two shows about aliens to um, a, a show um, about toilets is is quite bizarre. Um, it is a bit bizarre, but it also the even more bizarre thing about it. It sounds a little bit like you're saying that there's too many films being played about rapes and murders, and not enough about. Um, <laughs> I don't know if you mean that as a comedy sense, but the fact of the matter is on a serious level, right? Um, the, the fact is, uh, people do do these things and you don't hear about it and it's quite disgusting. It is a fact. It's it, it, I don't think you can use the word... You can use the word... Un Um, it's not normal. Hey, man. No. Shit on their cave paintings, right? <laughs> no, 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 they didn't. No, they, they didn't, Tom. No, I, 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 do you know what, right? Do you know what? Um, I've been involved in archaeology for a long time, right? And, and, and the one thing that, the, 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 it's very rarely that we like think, oh my God, you know, this place smells like urine, or, or this place smells like shit. You don't actually come across it. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, it's sort of hell. But I, but, it's but Tom, this is this is this this is this is civilization. This is, um, this is the um, this is year twenty twenty nineteen. It'll be twenty twenty soon, right? And the fact of the matter is, if people can't do simple things, I, 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 yeah. Can you? I bet you, right? People who who do um, um, Big Brother, right? I bet you there's examples where people have done this on the show, and they thought that we just can't broadcast this. <laughs> no, That's it's probably true, though, isn't it? no, I, I, I'm being deadly serious. I'm being deadly serious. It's just like, well, um, as 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 an actor, I I would never, um, I I would never, when 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 you do acting, right? You 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 implacably trust every single person on set. I don't know why, right? I don't know why. It's almost as if everybody on set is a human being, right? Because we're acting. Um, and I don't know why that is. It's almost as if we're all special, but you couldn't imagine anybody doing anything like that. However, can you imagine um, wearing somebody else's costume and they, and, and they act in this way and there's shit all over it? I, I can't... Oh God! I I I am sure I'm sure that's been known, but I, I I don't think it's ever been recorded. Um, I I want. Into the future, right? We'll bring out all this technology, and it just seems like a younger generation, like my generation, younger again, seems to be going backwards. What's that all about? Um, to to be to be honest with you, to be honest with you, I think I think it's about um parenting. I think. I, I think it's about children not really um, being given the proper parenting. Now, now you being a dad soon, 
right? You've got to install some values, and the values are not to do any of the things that we've been discussing. Well, actually, oh, even better, Tom, right? Um, don't eat with your mouth, don't eat at all whilst you go into the toilet. Yeah, that's, a, that's a weird taboo, isn't it? Because that's not normal, you don't see that in nature. Well, that's a human thing, that is. Oh, my... I, how, Oh my God, we've gone off in another direction. How many people do you... How, how do you get somebody to admit that they eat food whilst on the toilet? Ask my dad. Oh, I don't... Oh, great. Oh, well Ask then. Ask Jordan. Ask Jordan. I'll get on the phone to Jordan, right? So he's not only eating, he's also eating. Right? But he's also eating. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Right? Yeah. And he's talking to... Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. He's multitasking. He's doing four things. He's thinking. He's talking to you on the phone, he's eating and going to the loo. So that means, right, at the same time, he hasn't just done that, right? At some point in that conversation, he stood up and wiped his ass. Yeah? Whilst so he's been talking to me whilst he's been wiping his ass. That's bad, mate. Oh, God. What if there was a point where he'd done that? He's like, oh, there's no toilet paper. Oh my god. Maybe, maybe he's going to use the phone. <laughs> right, on that note, Tom, on that note, Tom, I just want to um I, I just want to ask right, what for the next show, right? Cuz this is this is the show between shows. So we've done two on aliens, right? Um uh, we've done like two and a half shows on aliens to be honest with you in a way. Um there's this one which doesn't even come into any category at all. Um uh, this is a shit show. Um and <laughs> Yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. Uh, th th that's exactly. Um, so for the next show, what do you want to do? I, we haven't had the chance to root through bins to try and find food to feed us. So I, I think what we need to do, we need to go all out on a ghost. We could do that. I, I think that would probably be the preferable one. I'm more interested in the ghost, fight. But maybe you should like, put up a poll on the KTFM website, whatever, yeah, yeah. the podcast. Yeah. What do you want in the next episode? Ghosts or freegans? Ah, uh, right, okay then. Is that what it's called? Freegans? Yeah, that's what they call them, freegans. The ones you go down things like beyond Tesco's and what they showed you. E e excellent. They've off the food that's thrown out. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Or, or, or if you're an animal, you eat off the feces that a, a human being threw out. Do, do you know, do you know, actually, if, um, do you know one thing, right? cultures in cultures in like thailand are so clean right because their their theses is used to feed the pigs that's not normal though that's no no apparently apparently right apparently you apparently apparently they do apparently what happens because in a human body right so much, so there's about, I don't know, like 20% of what we eat isn't digested, right? It goes through the system. And if you've noticed sweet corn, uh, that, that, that whenever somebody um, cleans out a cesspit, right, there's loads of sweet corn in it, right? And, and, and bits, bits of tomato and tomato seeds, right? All that type of stuff a pig eats. I gotta be honest with you, Tom. Do you do you, do, you, do you clean everything out from your nails? Yeah, I do. I cut my nails regular. Oh God. Flipping egg. Mm. On that note, Tom, I, I'm I'm completely worn out now. Um. Right, so what what we'll do? I'll put a survey on KTFM now because this is my Facebook day, and um, th this 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 show will be going out not not today, but in a few days because we're sort of in arrears because we've just only put. Um, episode 17 out so episode 8 this this episode um, obviously viewers don't need to know that but um, I'll put the survey up I'm guessing they're going to want the ghost one anyway that's my bet the people are going to because a lot of people listen to our show are fans of your ghost one 
talk anyway, so they're probably going to be ghost, ghost stories. And, well, not ghost stories, it ghost investigations, EMF. Oh, uh, e- um, EMF, EMFs, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know. I don't, I, I'm sure he's got them to say. Yeah, yeah, I'm just going to sit back and drink his water. Oh, wicked. Uh, well, that's brilliant. D- Daz every time. Exactly. Excellent. All right, All right then, Tom. Um, um, we'll, 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 we'll call it an, um, we'll call it a night for KTFM now. So this is, um, Carl James Lankford for KTFM. Um, this is a, a very odd episode, but, um, thanks for listening and, um, good night from me and. Good night.